Hi, I'm Rick from DxO Mark. We recently tested the rear camera on Xiaomi's latest addition to its line of high-end smartphones, the Xiaomi Mi 10 Pro. The Mi 10 Pro's release coincides with the company's 10-year anniversary as a smartphone maker. So let's see whether this new flagship device really gives Xiaomi something to celebrate. Here are some of the phone's highlights. First, when it comes to hardware, the Mi 10 Pro is packed with premium specs, including Qualcomm's new top-end and powerful Snapdragon 865 chipset, and a 6.67-inch display with full high-definition plus resolution. In the camera department, the Mi 10 Pro's hardware is similar to Xiaomi's heavy-hitting CC9 Pro Premium Edition released last year. That includes a large sensor, a 108-megapixel primary camera, and a 20-megapixel ultra-wide camera and dual telelenses for zoom. Thanks to the more powerful chipset and refined tuning, especially in areas of texture and night performance, the Mi 10 Pro's image results were excellent in both the photo and video categories. Now, let's highlight what this phone's camera can do. We'll start with exposure. When capturing still images, target exposure is stable and accurate. Xiaomi has improved the dynamic range over last year's CC9 Pro Premium Edition. There was slightly less highlight clipping in high contrast scenes, and HDR processing was better in bright outdoor and typical indoor conditions. Color is excellent overall, with generally accurate white balance when shooting outdoors in bright light and in indoor conditions. Our testers found colors looking a little washed out in some scenes, though with lower saturation than some competitors. The Mi 10 Pro is capable of capturing excellent detail. It earned the new top score for texture. Performance is, again, very similar to Xiaomi's previous release, the CC9 Pro Premium Edition. But the Mi 10 Pro has an edge with a slight improvement that is most noticeable in low light. In this bright light sample, you can see how the Mi 10 Pro is capable of squeezing a small amount of extra detail out of the scene when compared to the Mate 30 Pro 5G. The CC9 Pro Premium Edition is very close, but slightly underexposes the subjects in this shot. The Mi 10 Pro comes with an ultra-wide camera that is a great option for landscape and cityscape shots. With a 16mm equivalent lens, it is the middle of the pack in terms of field of view. As far as image quality, Xiaomi has managed to improve the level of detail and HDR processing over its predecessor, making it a very good option for wide-angle shooters. In fact, it was one of the best we have tested to date. Another area where the Mi 10 Pro excelled was in zoom performance, where it earned a top score. The device comes with improved dual zoom cameras, giving better detail and texture rendering that we can see when zooming in 5x, like in this portrait. The Mi 10 Pro also looks good next to the competition when shooting at a lower zoom range. This medium range shot shows a good detail for a zoom with good exposure and accurate white balance. On the downside, some zoom shots can show highlight clipping and ringing. The new model's night performance improved over the CC9 Pro Premium Edition with better dynamic range and detail. Overall detail rendering in low light is excellent, but in very low light, images can be underexposed and exposure in flash portraits can be suboptimal. The night landscape shot has good exposure and dynamic range, with well-managed noise and only a slight loss of detail. Image artifacts are fairly controlled on the Mi 10 Pro, but we applied some penalty points for flare and cyan shift. Also, some images showed chromatic aberrations along high contrast edges. Let's now turn to video. The Xiaomi Mi 10 Pro is our new top-ranked device for moving images. Its 4K video mode shows improved detail rendering and even more efficient video stabilization. Video showed pleasant colors, good exposure, and very good detail when recording in bright light or under typical indoor conditions. It also had wide dynamic range, which helps when filming high contrast scenes. Video stabilization is an additional strength, keeping things smooth and steady when walking while recording or when holding the camera still. All of these positive points make the Xiaomi Mi 10 Pro a more than suitable camera for video recording. In this example, you can see how the Xiaomi stabilization does a slightly better job than the Apple equivalent when recording while running. To sum up, here are the pros and cons.
Put all together, the Xiaomi Mi 10 Pro earned an outstanding overall DxO Mark camera score of 124, making it the new leader in our smartphone camera image quality ranking. We also tested the Mi 10 Pro for audio, where it earned a top overall score of 76. Check out our other audio and camera reviews at our website at dxomark.com and subscribe for more videos.